Eight magnificent cats were lost in 2018. Some were permanent residents of the Sunshine Home at this old cat. Others previously were temporary long-term boarders. This video is forged in their memory and in honor of their humans that loved them so dearly. Edith, a beautiful calico with gorgeous eyes, came to this old cat for lifetime care a few years ago and immediately captured her caretaker's hearts. She adjusted very well and made quite a few feline friends. Late 2018, Edith was diagnosed with metastatic breast cancer and with no cure, Edith's care switched to hospice. She passed away serenely on October the 29th at the age of 11. Zhang Tu was a Seal Point Burman, boarding at this old cat several times when the husband and wife owners traveled. Zhang Tu was the love of their lives. Sadly, the wife passed away a few years ago and then, early this year, 13-year-old Zhang Tu died, at home with a husband at his side. A short time later, the heartbroken husband also passed away. Sylvester's owner had adopted him while stationed in Guam. He first came to board at this old cat while his owner was deployed in Afghanistan. He went back home, however, he later returned for lifetime care after his owner had suddenly passed away. While at this old cat, Sylvester found a best friend in Rex, another lifetime care cat. Later in life, Sylvester suffered from severe skin allergies, seizures, heart, and renal diseases. A fighter right up until the very end, he died peacefully on January the 2nd at the age of 13. Rex was a chocolate Devon Rex, who came to this old cat a few years ago for lifetime care. He was one absolutely sweet little guy. He loved his caretakers, and he loved his feline friend Sylvester. Rex was a diabetic with IBD, chronic pancreatitis, and late-stage kidney disease. On top of all that, this year, he was diagnosed with heart disease. Rex persevered, but on December the 10th, his heart failed him. He was 17 years old. Rex is now at eternal rest, forever, with his best snuggle buddy, Sylvester. Jules was a chocolate Tonkinese from the UK. Not too long ago, Jules boarded at this old cat as his owner traveled for work. He returned home after successfully keeping several chronic diseases at bay. However, this past May, 15-year-old Jules lost the battle. He went peacefully at home, with his loving owner there by his side. Nim came to this old cat from Canada several years ago to board while his owner worked overseas. Unfortunately, he later was abandoned, and this old cat took him on for permanent lifetime care. Nim was a quiet soul, rarely meowing, rarely causing any ruckus, but he so much treasured being loved and took great comfort in snuggling with other cats. After being abandoned, Nim struggled with persistent heart disease, and in the end, he succumbed to his broken heart on May the 7th. He was 17 years old. Lincoln, a handsome Maine Coon, boarded at this old cat several years ago. He was such a character with a unique personality. His owners described Lincoln as being like a favorite grumpy uncle a lovable old guy. On his passing, they wrote that Lincoln had provided them with endless entertainment and exacerbation, tons of soft furry cuddles, and so much love and companionship. Lincoln was 16 years old when he passed away November 21st. Timmy Crackers, born in 1994, was a snow white cat, originally fostered by this old cat. That fostering eventually became permanent lifetime care. Timmy was blind, apparently from birth, but that never slowed him down. Like the Energizer Bunny, he kept going and going for well over two decades. Later in life, Timmy developed diabetes, IBD, and heart disease. Just days short of his 24th birthday, Timmy's heart could work no more. Timmy passed ever so peacefully on September the 14th. 
Rest in peace, beloved Edith, Zhang Tu, Sylvester, Rex, Jules, Nim, Lincoln, and Timmy Crackers. You shall forever remain on the minds and in the hearts of those that cherished you.